What is up everybody, Pokestan here and welcome back to another episode of the Pokemon Brilliant Diamond Nuzlocke. Guys, if you missed the last episode, then please make sure to check it out in the playlist link down in the description below. Because everything will be there. The rules, my social media, the subscription link, the like button even. So you can find everything down there. But with that said, let's get into it. Here is what our team is looking like. Gyarados, Gengar, Golbat, Alkazam, Empoleon, and Seraptor. To you Americans, this is being recorded on Thanksgiving, uh, although it'll probably go up- No, it, not probably. It will go up way later, but you know, it just has a nice time reference of when I'm recording these. Can I find my dad down there? Oh, okay, well, maybe. I don't know. What, Iron Island? You might be able to find them on Iron Island. Speaking of Iron Island, that's where we're headed. Let's go! Oh, do we need to have one open spot in our party? I swear to God. Waiting for us to team 989 U-turn, which is very nice. Very nice indeed. Why the f*** are you all following my Twitch? <laughs> Why are you following my Twitch? I don't even stream over there. What are you doing? I'm gonna turn that off now. Also, yeah, that is a Steins Gate reference, if you don't know. Um, Alright, we have an uh, Iron Island encounter. I don't know why that sounds so weird to say, but... Iron Island encounter. Okay. So, quickly... Quickly, though. Let me just whip this out real quick. This, the other one. Here we go. Force of Habit. Uh, force of Habit in Platinum. There's so many overlapping things that I just think are in this game, but are not because they're in Platinum originally. And it kind of pisses me off a little bit because I don't know where the line is drawn. Dude, where's our encounter, by the way? I feel like we should have gotten an encounter by now. I don't even know if there's anything new in here. The only thing new I can think of is freaking Steelix or like Onyx because I don't have an Onyx yet. Oh, there's our encounter. Can we get something busted? That's not busted. We already have one of those. I'm good. Wait, why did I put Gyarados up front? There's so many animations to sit through. Oh, the text box too. I hate that. Uh, okay, let me put Gengar up front, because we got Gengar can hold himself in a fight, right? Graveler. Do we get a Judo or no? I'm not against Graveler, necessarily. I'm not against him at all. I just- I'm just wondering if we got him or not. That's level 30. That's not bad, actually. If we don't have it, screw it. There's nothing new here anyways. <laughs> there's no- there's barely anything new here anyways. I don't really mind. I would have liked a Steelix, but Steelix is not the biggest thing, you know? Uh, let's name this Fadlix. Why not? <laughs> wait, no, I can just- wait, we get a PC box anywhere, right? That's pretty damn sick! I don't even know how much of this I'm actually cutting out, but I'm cutting out a good- a good bit because it gets really annoying when you're sat there with an hour of footage and then sifting through moments that you think are funny and then they're really actually not and then you just realize that you're just back at step one. And on top of trying to freaking do school stuff at the same time, it's a little bit- it's a little bit discombobulated. I'll do- I'll do Iron Island plus Byron for one episode and then we'll do- we'll do the lake stuff for the other. Oh, two of the lakes, not- not all three, because there's no shot I'm doing all three in one episode, because you know how far Snowpoint is? <laughs> Staraptor. I don't understand why people at this stage of the game still have us freaking Staravia. Also, do any of you find it weird at all that um, Staravia's DP sprite has his peak pointing downwards? Like, it's actually down instead of straight. That's weird. You, you've never played the originals either. Oh, you, like, are you saying you never played the originals either? Hmm. I mean, they're basically the same. Let's be real. They're, they're basically the same. 100% of the main game is pretty much the same. It's just, uh, it, the extra that they added. You know, it's basically 100% the same, just like 110. Okay, you're Daniel. I'm Riley. Also, can I just say that I love the 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 skin the the hollow wear they put in Unite for Lucario. It's literally just Riley, but it's just so cool. Too bad if costs like a, a kidney and a bone. Jesus Christ! I don't think if okay, you know, fun fact, and a lot of you might literally just click off after I say this, right? But I have never, I don't think I've ever eaten a proper burrito in my damn life. You can quote that. And I still- and I still have it. <laughs> I still have it. I have done nothing to fix it, because I just- I- I don't like eating new things, you know? Like, maybe every once a year I'll try something- <laughs> I'll try one thing new, but like, I don't- I don't- I don't typically do that. Nor taco. I should- I should- I should mention. I don't think I've had a proper, like, taco. Taco. Alright, come on, Zubat, you can go die now. 
We're fighting single battles. I just realized that. I should have fought the double battle. I'm dumb. Uh, now I have to deal. Now I have to do this like twice. Okay, no, I should. I should fight the double battles from here on out. Again, this is just force of habit because I played Nuzlocks a lot, right? And typically in Nuzlocks, I don't want to fight double battles because double battles are hella scary. Because they can just double in on you, and then you just lose your mon right right there on the spot. And it just becomes a very um, annoying process of uh, trying to explain how the hell that happened to the chat. Uh, I just typically like doing sing singles, because you can typically control more more of the situations in singles. Uh, Scarlet's Bull in high school, and I used... Uh, I was only used for the miscellaneous kit. Oh! <laughs> okay. God dang, okay, so you're just a pot of knowledge. I mean, that's kind of cool in its own way, to be fair. Like, you're uh, like you're a jack of all trades, basically. I mean, you know a lot of things. I don't know how well you know a lot of the things, but you know a lot of things. And sometimes that's better than uh, not knowing anything about anything in school related at all. So, like me, because I can tell you, I know what I know, and I pretty, I'm, I know what I know pretty well. But Jesus Christ, when it comes to things related to school, I cannot give you a f***ing sentence on a single damn topic. Because I just don't care enough to know. Pot of useless knowledge? Yeah, you know what? That's... I mean, hey. You invested in your time in what you wanted to do. And I can respect that. A lot of people would probably sh** on you for that. <laughs> just because, like, it's useless. Why would you even bother? I'm just like, hey, you do you, bro. You do you. Like, I know Pokemon like the back of my hand. It's always just on my head. If you ask me anything, I'll probably know it within, like, five... Five to ten seconds, probably. At, at like, top, tops, I'm saying. Tops. Dude, you ask me about math or f history, I will not be able to recite a single damn thing. I don't remember anything from school. <laughs> I can tell you stuff about computers and stuff. Mm -hmm, kind of. But Pokemon, yeah, I got Pokemon down pat, bro. Don't even question it. Uh, I okay, as a athletic, but you didn't do any sports. Oh, I mean, yeah, there are some people like that. Like, they have the talent for it. They're, it's just not necessarily something that, that they want to do. Right? That's uh, completely understandable. I, on the other hand, don't have a talent for anything, so, like, I just kind of just do this because I just find it the most fun. Uh, you get a Rayola dig? Yeah, I know. And I'm gonna probably put it on my team, uh, as well, because why not? The only problem about Riolu is that it has a happiness evolution. You all know how much- how I feel about that, and we have one on the damn squad, and he hasn't evolved yet, which is pissing me off. Friendship evolution is not very fun to deal with. Not only is it friendship, it's friendship that has to be during the damn day! But yeah, no, definitely. A lot of people, like, have the talent for something, they just don't want to do it. Which, you know, I guess, if you're not feeling the passion for it, like, yeah, I don't think you really want to do something that you don't feel passion for. I just have no talent for anything in particular. I mean, I guess you could say that I have a talent for, you know, video stuff. If I, if I was given enough time, I could probably make a banger something. But I, you know, I'm trying to keep up with the trends here because BDSP is kind of going up, you know? So, like, I need to, I need to make these consistent. Why do you get f by the level 34? What the f*** is wrong with you, Zoo? What the f***? Why does he get this stupid move so late? I don't know, like, how do you quantify passion is the thing? Or how do you qualify passion? It's a very open-ended question, I feel like. Listen, I have a Pokemon egg here. Would you take it with you? Yeah, sure, why not? <laughs> sure, why not? The egg has been added to your party. Uh, was so pissed I had a chance for a National Honor Society being done. Wow. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's just- hey, I mean, you do what you're happy with. There are certain extents to that, of course. Just don't, like, f*** your life over by doing what you think makes you happy, right? There's obviously things that you're gonna have to do. But for the most part, as long as you're not hurting anyone, or as long as you're not hurting yourself either, do whatever the f*** you want, really. <laughs> that's just my perspective on things. Just like, hey, if you're not hurting anyone, or if you're not hurting yourself, more importantly, you go ahead. No one's stopping you. Oh, dude, this gym looks so cool. I always love the look of this gym. It's so freaking cool. All right, so uh, steel types, right? Good thing we lost our fire type last time. Water type resist steel. That's true, but I have nothing super effective against steel. Luckily for me, most steel types are either rock or ground type, so it works out. Unless it's scissor. <clears throat> In which case, it doesn't. But you know what? We'll, we'll 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 get there when we get there. Is this the right way? Thank God. I know this gym puzzle, bro. I know this puzzle. See, I'm. I just said steel type. Oh, sorry. I just said scissor. But like this trainer in platinum normally does have a scissor. I don't know if she, I don't know if he does here. What part of this screams steel type? I'm, I'm, okay, D Diamond and Pearl has some whack mons, okay? I don't even know what their decisions were in this game, or why they decided to make it like that again. Now you got a steel type. Why didn't you just have two Steelix? 
you may as well have just had two Steelix at that point. I love just surfing everything. This is just free. <laughs> this is so free. I literally just one shot everything because water type beats ground type. Hey yo, it's a steel type gym. It doesn't make sense, but then again, when did Pokemon ever make sense? Bro, for crying out loud, a, 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 a whooper can learn Ice Punch. And something with actual arms couldn't. I'm just trying to think of from the top of my head. What move does Garupi get that's actually Steel type? Iron, oh, Iron Tail. I guess so, yeah. Mm hmm. You know, think about it. Y you're right. You're totally right. But let's be real Iron Tail can miss a lot. <laughs> it's like 75 accuracy. Like I always say, if it's under 100% if it's under accuracy, it may as well be zero. Thoughts on Mario being added to Ultimate? I'm not gonna lie to you, that was very surprising to me when I found that out, because I could not believe it. I, I didn't think they would do it. I didn't think they would do it with the many loopholes, the many legal loopholes that they had to jump through. Okay, I, I, I didn't think they would do it, but god dang it, they freaking made the impossible possible. And honestly, I'm pretty proud of Sakurai for doing that. Now just replay what all I just said, but replace Mario with Sora, okay? There you go. <laughs> It's funny. It's absolutely insane that they actually did that. Dude, Mario Mario. They added the the Mario Mario into Super Smash Bros. Ultimate for the Nintendo Switch. Absolutely ludicrous. Can't believe that. They they got the Prime Brothers, the face of gaming. Well, at least the face of gaming originalities. The ultimate cr fighting crossover of all damn time. Hello, Brian. How you doing? How you doing, mate? Ah, that's Orbuck's gym badge. I see, I see. You've defeated my son. But that's no surprise, he still has much to learn. In place of my son, Rourke, I, Byron, will accept your challenge. I think he's had a, a lot more jolly in the anime, but... Yeah, Bronzer, sick. It's like, I just remember these things, you know? You know I'm surprised. This is a Steel-type gym. Two of the trainers in here had a freaking Skorupi and a, a Zoomerill. Why the hell couldn't they just have had a Bronzor? It was literally right there. Oh, you're smart. Kind of. You're, you're not really, but you're trying to be smart. And that, uh, you know, I can give you credit for that. X, let's go. Mm. It should be a one shot. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, okay. That's not a one shot. All right, Bronzor's thicker than I thought. Well, I mean, okay. Well, that's not going to do you much good, no, is it? Well, now our Hex is going to be half, right? Nope, it did more. <laughs> it just did more. What? Wait, does confusion not count as a status? I, I guess it doesn't for Hex. I, I guess not. All right, sick. Steelix! We'll be here and just gonna eat my- Oh! Oh, wait, Sandstorm. Oh. That doesn't really do anything for you, now does it? Okay, well, you're just gonna get one shot now, right? You're just gonna surf, and you're dead. You're dead. Of course not, because you have Sturdy. Why would- Why? I hate this. Stop wasting my damn time. <clears throat> Now, you might be wondering, this is a, was a very stupid decision, but guess what? It's not, because I can just punt it into the, the middle of next week. Oh, or not, it has sturdy. Oh, boy. This is... Oh. 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 You want to do your move now? Oh. Funny. It has Thunderbolt. Guess what? It, it has dead. You are strong enough to take down my prize team of Pokemon. In recognition of that power, I give you this. The Mind Badge. Having the Mind Badge enables you to use the hidden move strength from your Poketch anytime. You now have six gym badges. That means all Pokemon up to level 70 will obey you without question. Here, take these two. Yay. Hey, that's the Mind Badge. Good going. You're, you're, you're even tough enough to- ugh, I don't know why I had a brain for You're even tough enough to take a shot at becoming a- little da 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 I'm not even gonna try. <laughs> I'm not even gonna try. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode. If you guys did enjoy, please leave a like on the video. And subscribe to the channel if you aren't already. Ring the bell so you don't miss on any notifications, whether that be streams or uploads. But of course, you can also just- you know, check the description below for the for social media links and stuff like that. If you got a Twitter, follow me on Twitter. I like to I like to post there first and foremost if anything goes down that is unexpected. So, with that said, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys for the next one. Peace!